Hey guys, it's me again. Today is Friday, March the 12th, 2010. It is day 71 of the Project Jesus 365. Um, continuing on tonight in 1 John chapter 4, verse 9. So, here we go. In this was manifested the love of God toward us, because that God sent His only begotten Son into the world that we might live through Him. Herein is love, not that we loved God, but that He loved us, and sent His Son to be the propitiation for our sins. You know, that, that reminds me of something that uh, Jeff used to say. You know, it's a good thing that God loves us and is more faithful to us than we are to him you know most of the time and that's kind of what it means here you know not that we love God not because we love God so much why he sent Jesus because he loves us you know just think about that and I'll finish verse 10 or again and send his son to be the propitiation <clears throat> for our sins you know he's the uh, he was a substitute you know for us Verse 11 reads on, Beloved, beloved, if God so loved us, we ought also to love one another. No man hath seen God at any time. If we love one another, God dwelleth in us, and his love is perfected in us. Hereby know we that dwell in him, and he in us, because he hath given us his spirit. And we have seen and do testify that the Father sent the Son to be the Savior of the world. Whosoever shall confess that Jesus is the Son of God, God dwelleth in him, and he in God. And we have known and believed the love that God hath to us. God is love, and he that dwelleth in love dwelleth in God, and God in him. Herein is our love made perfect, that we may have boldness in the day of judgment, because as he is, so are we in this world. There is no fear in love, but perfected love casteth out fear, because fear hath torment. He that feareth is not made perfect in love. We love him because he first loved us. Ain't that the truth? If a man say, I love God, and hateth his brother, he is a liar. For he that loveth not his brother whom he hath seen, how can he love God whom he hath not seen? And this commandment have we from him, that he who loveth God love his brother also. Guys, just think about some of these things. You know, we need to, you know, we need to love, try to love everybody. And, you know, a lot of people think they miss interpret it interpret this just as oh lovey dovey lovey peace and and don't say nothing to nobody that's not what this is talking about you know uh this is talking about you know in my opinion caring for other people you know and actually caring enough to do what needs to be done you know caring enough to tell them they're doing wrong if they are uh caring for people enough to Give them money when they don't have it, if you know, if you can, or giving them food or whatever, uh, just whatever, guys. You know, just just whatever you can do uh, to help each other out. You know, because times are getting tough when, and uh, you know, we really need words like this right now. We need to, we need people to do these actions. You know, to care, let's care for each other and help each other out. But anyway, guys, I thank you all for watching, and uh, I'll see you tomorrow. Bye.